my idea of perfect happiness would be uh, just, you know, having your family and your friends and everybody happy around you, I think. Um, no pressure, just, uh, just being uh, around loved ones and, yeah, being happy. My greatest fear um, would be probably um, deadly snakes and spiders. <laughs> Um, historical fear I identify with, um, that's a hard one. I think I definitely uh, look at historical figures um, throughout, um, you know, in literature and in movies and things like that and often um, wonder how in real life, in real time, we'd portray them. Um, I think, look, I have idols, um, you know, obviously like Joan of Arc and people like that that you think are just amazing women. Um, but I think in terms of recent history, I'd have to say my mother, <laughs> which is funny, but yeah. Well, um, the, the living person that I most admire would be my mum. You know, she's just someone that I've looked up to my entire life and I really respect her um, and just the way that she handles situations and, and life. So um, I think that would definitely be my mother. Um, the characteristic I most dislike in myself is um, I, I probably tend to get a little bit worked up over things um, and stress a little bit too much sometimes when it's not needed um, and therefore maybe am a little bit irrational um, so I'd probably I'd have to say that. Uh, intense intensity kind of you know in, in daily life not obviously in basketball but I think in daily life when you're having a conversation with someone and they're overly intense and really um, full-on I, I find that quite unnerving so um, I'd have to say probably just intensity um, it's yeah it's hard for me to sort of swallow sometimes <laughs> My greatest extravagance would probably be, oh, maybe my, my coast house, uh, where I, I live um, on the south coast of Australia. I, I, it's amazing there and I love that. Um, but I, I don't know, maybe my, probably just properties that I own, you know. Um, I'm the happiest when I'm here in Australia, like uh, just, and, and with my family, of course. Um, Probably when I'm in Albury, where I was born and raised, um, I just love being there. I feel just a sense of calm and um, I just feel like I'm home, you know, and that's where I'm happiest. If I could change one thing about myself, I would change um, my eating habits. I love food too much. I wish I didn't love it as much as I do, but I can't help it. <laughs> My greatest achievement um, in basketball would be, uh, you know, world championship gold medal. That was great. Um, I think off the court, just, um, you know, university, I think studying, um, I find a lot of satisfaction in that. And um, yeah, that, I mean, to date, I think off court, um, yeah, what I achieve at school is definitely very important to me. Uh, my most treasured possession would be uh, things that um, you know I, I've over time gathered, whether it's from people that I've loved or um, lost. You know, I think just memories like uh, you know jewelry that reminds you of someone or um, any. I mean, things like that. Basically, things that just mean a lot to me. I'd never wear it, but I always look at it and think of great times or people that I've cared about deeply. So I think um, probably you know just. Um, yeah, those sort of things. My heroes in real life are, again, back to my mother. You know, she obviously has had a huge influence on my life and, um, you know, I've, I want to be like her. You know, I, I've made an active decision that I want to um, 
be the sort of person she is. And I mean, to respect um, your mother the way that I respect mine, I think is pretty special. So, um, you know, and I just admire her. So I'd have to say my mum again. <laughs>